brothers and sisters in Christ, hunters of lost souls, I thank you for joining me this morning as I continue in my praise and worship, as I give God the glory of waking me up this morning with the same purpose, with a little bit more vision and a little bit more drive and a more zeal and a passion even than what I had yesterday. And I just thank God for that. It's something only he can do as, as we walk through every day and we look towards him each day, making him more and more of our thoughts and our thoughts more on him, our conversations on him. And we just let God speak to us through, through our spirit and let him speak to those around us. And he'll, he'll give us more of a purpose because if, if we're faithful and little, then he's going to give us more to be faithful about. We're going to get to be faithful in much. And so as we give it to God every day, just know that there's reason for everything that we go through. But always know you have the victory already in Jesus' holy risen name. Dear Heavenly Father God, I come to you this morning thanking you for each and every one that's on the other end of this video, dear God. I just ask you to send your Holy Spirit out, dear God, and get, get those that wouldn't usually even listen, dear God. I ask you just to, to get them to their curiosity to to prick their heart and their mind dear god to to bring them to hear your word and and what you have to say dear god because you are so you're you're such an awesome loving caring god and you 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 remain so close to me through even the hardest times when i was alone whenever i was was on the streets and I couldn't go home. You you gave me you gave me everything, dear God. You gave me everything I needed. You gave me it all. You gave me You gave me such a story, dear God. But more importantly, the seeds that were planted, dear God. That I just ask you that they be watered as I know they are because I planted them in your holy name. And I know you take care of what you plant. And I just thank you today, dear God, for giving us the victory. I just ask you just to, to be with me, dear God. Speak through me. Don't let anything be of me, dear God, but all of I am you, dear God, the great I am. I thank you for everything that you are everything that you always have been you've never changed from the beginning of time until the end of time you're going to be the same god yesterday tomorrow and forever and i just thank you father god for that and in that i know that i have victory through the blood of jesus amen i heard an old old story how a savior came from glory how he gave his life on calvary to save a wretch like me i heard about his groaning of his precious blood's atoning and I repented of my sin and won the victory. Oh, victory in Jesus, my Savior forever. He sought me and bought me with his redeeming blood. He loved me, I knew him, and all my love is due him. He plunged me to victory beneath the cleansing flood. I heard about his power, of his 
cleansing blood. Oh, dear Lord. Dear Lord, I'm sorry, y'all. This song, I've been working on it my whole life, pretty much. And I have problems with it going through it every time. This is actually the fourth time I've I've recorded this. So I'm going to start off where I was. If y'all don't mind, hang in there. I heard about his healing of his cleansing power revealing <clears throat> well y'all i'll do that some other time god ain't obviously he ain't want me to do that for y'all yet but just know that there's victory to claim in his holy risen name that's why it's the only way we're going to remain it's the only way we can sustain i tell you he is the one true king he's the one all this love he'll bring i tell you he'll make your heart sing in everything i tell you he's the one true king he's the one he's going to make your heart sing you just got to give it to him we got to go and tell them i tell you every boy and girl yeah the whole wide world i tell you it's all about my jesus i tell you he He's the only one that pleases. He never teases. No, he always eases my mind. He's always putting the past behind. He's always filling me with this love. I tell you, it's the kind. It's the kind of love that only God knows. It's a breath of life that only he could blow. I tell you, this is all that I know. I'm just telling you about the one that has my soul. He is the one that made me whole. I tell you, he put me on that road. Up yonder, how I never more had to ponder. No, I don't have to think twice. There's no roll of the dice. Jesus Christ, he is my only advice. He made himself my sacrifice when he paid the price i tell you upon the cross with the blood that he lost he paid the cost it was worth more than what was lost just to give me this life so i could rise beyond the worry and the strife he cut those ties with the knife i tell you when he went to the cross with the blood that he lost i tell you it was worth more than what was lost because he gave us this life so we could live beyond the worry and the strife we gotta give it to him i tell you but we got to go and tell them we got to let them know you have a lost world i tell you every boy and girl huh every man and woman i tell you we gotta go we gotta let them know we gotta let them know about the one that has our soul he's the only reason that i've got this flow i tell you back in the trap i couldn't rap no i couldn't rhyme not anytime now it's line after line i tell you it's all about my jesus he's the only one that pleases he's the one that put this Wrap in my soul, I tell you, he's the one. He's the one that put me on that road. Up yonder, how I never more had to ponder. No, I don't have to think twice. There's no roll of the dice. Jesus Christ, he made himself our sacrifice. I'm telling you, that's why he's got to be our only advice. I tell you, this life, huh, it's but a vapor. No longer have to do I chase that paper. I tell you, no, it's a new life. It's without the worry and the strife. No longer do I tweak. No, but I tell you of my sweet Savior, I do reek. Huh? I tell you of the Holy Spirit, I speak. It's all of him. It's nothing of me. I tell you I'm going to serve him for eternity. I got an eternal destiny. I've got to let him know it's a decision between heaven or hell. We better choose the one that they did nail to the tree. I tell you on Calvary, he's the one. He died for our eternity. He is the only way, the truth, and the life. Jesus is the one that rose beyond the worry and the strife. I tell you, we got to spread the word. We got to sing it like a bird. We got to tell them how on that third day, how the stone was rolled away. I tell you, it was a holy righteous day because he rose all the way up into the heavens. I tell you, I'm dreaming about 7-Eleven. I don't know about all these threes. I tell you, they're coming at me. Huh? All these fours and the fives lining up all the time. I tell you, I don't understand. All I know is he's telling me I'm right where I need to be. I just got to look to him for eternity. I tell you, he's the one that reigns supremacy. He is the way, the truth, and the life. I tell you, my Jesus, he's the one that rose beyond the worry and the strife. I'm going to continue to give it to him, I tell you. I'm going to keep going and telling them how he was with me right there in Haskell County when I couldn't even pay my bounty. No, it was just me and my Jesus. 
Jesus all alone. We didn't have a phone. I couldn't call home. I tell you, how I bet my Jesus, he was right there in the middle of the cell. Even when it appeared like hell, you couldn't tell because I was right there with the one that they did nail to the cross. Yeah, with the blood that he lost, he paid a cross. Huh? It was worth more than what was lost. But I tell you, the risen king, I tell you, huh, the love that he did bring right there in the middle of my pod, he had me stand up and worship my one true God. I told him all the story, the one that my Jesus had given me from glory. I tell you, I had no reason to worry because he was right there with me all the way. I tell you, even every day, he, when I said that prayer right there in the middle of my cell, I tell you, I, I asked him to take me around the world, but uh, he took me out to New Mexico. Yeah, I'm telling you, the same God that took down the walls of Jericho, huh, he had me out there telling the same story, the one that he's given me from glory. That's where he gave me this rap. That's when he took me out of the trap. I tell you, huh, I was letting them know out there. I was telling them, be aware how he's given me this story. I tell you, I'm going to tell you it, it came from glory. Huh, how he sent his spirit ascending down like a dove. I tell you how it filled me with this holy righteous love. How it gave me this new way to walk. A different way to talk. I tell you I always heard about it having a song in the middle of your heart. Now I tell you I never want it to depart. Huh. I tell you this is more than an art. This is something only God could create. I tell you we gotta serve the great. The great I am. The one that come and done everything he said he's going to do. He's come through for me and every one of you who choosing to believe, not to let the devil deceive. For if you want to receive, you know you've got to believe that Jesus Christ, he's my only advice. He is the way, the truth, and the life. He's the only way we can rise beyond the worry and the strife. I tell you, we got to give it to him. We got to go and tell them. Every boy and girl, yeah, I tell you, the whole wide world, we got to spread the word. We got to sing it like a bird. We got to tell them how he rose on that third day. I tell you, the stone was rolled away. Huh, he rose up to that holy, righteous way. I tell you, he rose into the heavens. I tell you, all these seven and eleven, all these threes, as I'm walking under the trees, I tell you, huh, I don't understand. Everything goes hand in hand. I tell you, as I walk with the one true man, the one that really could, the one that did, and the one that will, the one that's going to do everything he knows he's going to do. He said he's going to do it through me and every one of you. All you got to choose to believe huh, if you want to receive, because it's all about our Jesus, I tell you. He's the one. Don't let the devil deceive because he's going to try to lead you down this broad, open path that looks easy, looks beautiful as you start to walk down it. But it's as you get to walking, the, the glitter and the shine, the sparkle starts to fade. I believe it's Casting Crown sings a song, Slow Fade. It is a slow fade, so be careful. Be careful. Don't, don't let your light fade. Let Jesus continue to fill you. Even if depression starts to hit, if you're weak, mind allows Satan to try to creep in if your weak heart has trouble believing we got to look to Jesus we got to sing a praise and a worship song if I didn't start every morning as I started praising and worshiping my Savior. Asking him, Father, just give me a praise and a worship worthy to, to give to you. As that is all I have. I have nothing else to give. 
I want to. I feel like I need to, but I can't. But I have this praise and this worship. I have this praise and this worship that is a burning desire. That's a burning desire to, to share the holy gospel of Jesus Christ. As roadblocks have been set up in my way, I know that my father, I know he's working behind the scenes to make my path clear, to make his path clear in me. As his vision in me comes clearer and clearer, as he shows me that he's making a way where there seems to be none, as he speaks to me, through his word, through those that he's put in my life, the music that he's put in my life, it's something that, it's amazing how God is a confirming God. He will confirm to you the things that he's already told you. As you walk in his way and you do his will, you'll see confirmation upon confirmation all along the way. And all you gotta do is continue to look to the one true king, the risen king, Jesus Christ. God, come down, walked, wrapped in flesh, living a perfect, unblemished life. He walked through the worry and the strife. So don't think for a moment that we're gonna get away from walking through the worry and the strife. But here's one thing, our God, our risen Savior, He made us a promise. He made us a promise. It's written in red that we shall have these things here on earth as we're going to have in heaven. If we do the will of the Father and we ask the Father to fill us with his Holy Spirit to make his thoughts our thoughts, his concerns our concerns, what he loves, the things that we love, the people we love. If we don't do the will of the Father, I can tell you, you can rest assured knowing that knowing Jesus Christ and accepting him as your Lord and Savior has been enough. But, I pray that you have unrest until you realize the will of the Father is to share His love with everyone that He's put in your life. Somehow, some way, we've got to find a way. I tell you, we're going to fall. We're we're going to we're going to veer, but we've got to endeavor to persevere. Don't fear. Because the Holy Spirit, he'll steer every step, every, everything you say. It, at times it's going to be hard and you're, you might have to bite your tongue. You might slip. You might say some things you really didn't mean. But you've got to come to them after, after you've given time. you got to come back and you got to make things right. You got to let them know if you said anything that wasn't right or if you done anything that wasn't right, you're sorry in Jesus' name and that you just, you want to make it right. And it's all for him that Satan, he's going to use different tactics, so many different ways. Those that are unlovable and that are running, 
they're gonna find the little things that we do and say wrong and they're gonna make a big thing out of it it's gonna hurt us in the heart that anyone would think the things that Satan is gonna try to say to us as we go throughout our days He's gonna say so many things. He's gonna to try to use whoever he can use to try to get us off of our purpose to think we're not worthy and that we don't deserve what God has to give us, what he's promised us. We've gotta give it to God. And we've gotta give it to him daily. From the time we wake up and our feet hit the ground as we go through our day we got to try to pray all along the way that Jesus that our Heavenly Father will make us more like Him that we might be able to affect someone wherever we go whatever we do no matter where it is even if it's just going to the grocery store if it's going to church and letting someone see your praise and worship just do that as it's to God it's not for who anybody that's around you it's for him the one true king the one all the love that he'll bring how he'll make your heart sing and when he puts this song in your heart pray that it never depart because I'm telling you it's not it's more than an art it's something that's God given and it becomes purpose driven it's all in the way you're living we ain't got to be perfect. We can't be perfect. But at the time we lay down in bed, and we lay down our head, we need to pray that this flesh be dead so that in the morning we can strive to be alive so that we can drive towards the purpose that God has put in us so that God can take us from the greater glory to greater glory giving us greater story to greater story all for his glory and his story it's all about him nothing about us anything that's come from me today that comes from me anytime from going on from the time before anytime you've heard from me that's something I prayed nothing of it be of me if it ever be about me huh all I could do is ask that you'd pray of me pray for me but I'm afraid if at that point there'd be nothing that that you could do for me because that'd be the unforgivable sin to let my flesh speak to you in Jesus' name claiming the Holy Spirit there's a reason that I haven't been able to make this message on here and do this post yet and it's all because of God and his time and if if there's anything that's been said that you've seen or heard God won't allow it to ever be posted so if you're seeing this God allowed you to see it for a reason and a purpose as he's given me a reason and a purpose to speak As God's telling me, it's time to elevate. There's no time to hesitate. We got to do this thing with something only God can create. 
it's all a mystery but one day it's all going to be history his story I tell you we do it for his glory yes we do it we have no reason to worry it's all for his glory I tell you life is but a vapor no longer after that life old life do I chase no not even the paper I tell you no longer do I tweak and now of my Jesus I tell you I reek because I'm a Jesus freak of my Jesus everywhere I go this is all that I know and it's my Jesus that I speak it's letting the Holy Spirit be heard huh it's letting them know not to fear it it's the word I tell you it's all about my Jesus he's the only one that pleases my soul I tell you he's made me whole he put me on the roll up yonder I never more had to ponder I don't have to think twice there's no roll of the dice Jesus Christ he made himself our sacrifice when he paid the price upon the cross with the blood that he lost I tell you he paid the cost but don't be in despair or dismay because it was worth more than what was lost because our Jesus he went down into the pit he was laid down in the tomb but I tell you he sent zoom zoom to tell you he rose up out of the tomb on that third day when the stone was rolled away he rose all the way high above the worry and the strife that he endured his whole life but let me tell you as we accept him more and more every day as our faith grows stronger and stronger every day we pray that we be strengthened mentally physically and spiritually as this ain't nothing about rituals this ain't nothing about the physical life it ain't nothing about mental mental life it's a spiritual warfare if satan's attacking your brain we need to strengthen up our helmet of salvation if god's a, if if god's not you don't have god strong enough protecting your your spirit if you're not filled with him enough and your soul's being attacked by worry fear and doubt your soul's act satan's actually speaking to your soul putting these things in there you're allowing the the words of others of the world to get within your soul we need to strengthen our breastplate of righteousness we need to strive to be a little bit more like jesus if our feet aren't walking the path that we're speaking if our feet and our walk is telling a lie and our walking and our talking ain't matching up well we need to get in the word a little bit more and figure out what the word says the letters in red we need to figure out the gospel of jesus christ and what it's really all about so we got to have our feet shod with the preparation of the gospel if we don't have the words to say or if we're speaking bad words words that we ought not say because we have to have sword of the spirit which proceeds from the mouth 
the tongue, the tongue is sharper than any two-edged sword. And when it's got the Holy Spirit speaking through it, and you're speaking the words of God because you you know the gospel you know the word of God you can cut through anything with your words so if you don't have the words to say there's some learning to be done there's some learning to be done If things just aren't going right, if things just aren't going right and the darts just keep hitting you and piercing you, if they ain't making it to your heart because you got your breastplate on, but they're hitting you all over, all over making life uncomfortable for you. <coughs> Making life miserable. Things just won't go right. I don't understand why. I don't know why. Why does Satan, how does these attacks keep hitting me directly? Why do they keep affecting me? Why do I keep going to jail? Why do I keep getting these tickets? How's your faith? Do you have your shield up? Do you have your shield up? Get your shield up. Get aligned with God. Figure out His will. Learn His word. If you haven't been raised up in it, get in it. If you know it, do it. I feel like a failure every day because there's a few people that I don't get to talk to. There's so many more that I want to reach. There's so more, so many more that I want to be able to teach through my walk, through my talk. Not just my words, but by my, my actions. But then also by the kindness of the words that come from my mouth. The words of love, the words of life. It's all about Jesus.